girl that detested cherry blossoms because it signaled events where she was always so lonely changing of classes graduation but this time it's different she's not lonely anymore and we might actually get to be in the same class or we're getting baited i doubt it let's begin the reaction second year i can't read japanese where did you land Ooh. oh Mahiru and Amane, same class? Best friends, still same class? Okay, that's, that's three out of four. Boom! Boom! Hold up, all four of us got in the same class. I think that was to be expected though, right? Now, how will the class dynamics change now we're in the same class? Oh, look at her peeking over. I think she's happy about this. Wait, the prince of the school, same class? Oh, they keep showing us. I mean... We haven't really gotten much of him other than the interaction. The fuck? That was him a long time ago? Or is it a different character? Different character. Okay. That's before he transferred here, right? We got a, like a tiny glance of his past back then, but I think this guy's actually a good person. Because the person that he just got reminded of probably like seemed like a good person in the beginning, but then it ended up into a really like, I don't know, like a bullying environment. But I think he's different because we saw in the Valentine's episode how he gave him a little gift of the extra bag to carry the chocolates, right? He seemed like thankful. She want a head pad? Yeah, sure, okay. Hmm. She wouldn't usually do this, right? Hmm. Is this the same girl? Did the impact from episode 7, you know, the, all that emotional bonding? No, that's very appealing, but she's changed a bit, right? I'm not reading too deep into this, right? Holy shit, we're getting a lap pillow. I mean, episode 7, right? It, it was a lot of development. She was like pouring her heart out about her past, you know, past like trauma with her childhood. And I'm gonna kind of just took it all in. And like, we had a little bit of like, you know, please look at me more, that kind of moment. So, hmm. Maybe it's time for... We got a little bit of Mairu's past. I think it's time for Amane's past now. Give us a flashback. <laughs> what a giga chad. Puts his face on her lap. Says nothing. No. Keep patting my head. Okay, keep stroking it. Keep stroking it. <laughs> relax, relax. Mm, are we still trying to hide that? Hey, you. A little pinch too. Damn. Mayuru's being a lot more affectionate and a little bit more straightforward. Like, hey, lap pillow. <laughs> Stroking your hair. <laughs> pinch. Because huh. before we're trying to really hide the relationship between us two in public, but now maybe things might be different. Maybe we can actually, I don't know, be formally dating in public too? Would the public perception of that be kind of bad? I don't know. Would, would, we, would she care about what other people think? I don't think so. Spoil me rotten. Title drop. Oh, double pinch this time. Hmm. Yo, at this rate, this relationship is going to develop to a point where she's the one wearing the pants. She's the one that's going to be like pushing him around. You know? Look at her. Look at her just running around him right now. I think, uh, I think some guys do prefer to be pushed around like that though. More pinch. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> yeah, she's being very pushy. She's being very pushy. I wonder if Chitose kind of like told uh, Mairu about this. Like, you gotta be more pushy with him. No, I think you should do it in public. I think it'd be a lot more cute. Oh, called her a bug. I remember before when she's like, bug. <laughs> it's the other way around this time. I think he got her a gift. Yeah. From the poly thing. Mr. Kuma is gonna have a friend. A couple friends. Oh, there's a little bunny this time. Well, Mr. Kuma got so many friends. Oh my god, it's so adorable. There's a dog, cat. I thought a penguin and a panda bear. Oh my goodness. She's just so happy. <laughs> They're all gonna be sleeping with her in the same bed with Mr. Kuma now. There's so many of them. It's an entire zoo. Oh, look at her covering her face. <laughs> you hey, you're the one that said, please look at me more. Remember? Remember? 
I don't think anybody would like look at a girl with a bunch of plushies and be like, huh, what a child, look at her. Like, no, I don't think it's like that at all. Oh, I suppose I can? Sure. <laughs> yeah? Anything. Give me anything? Oh. My dude says pudding with a lot of eggs and she just said, I'll offer you anything I can do. You know the best answer would that be? It would be, all I need is you. Egg pudding. She's like, which kind of eggs do I need to buy? Oishi. Umai. I like this new like hoodie thing that she's wearing today. I haven't seen her wear it yet until this episode. Yes. So happy. So beyond happy. Delicious meal every day. And then he's like, oh, it's so delicious because you made it. Oh, and then she gets all blushed. I mean, this is the formula, you know, it's been like, I know they're kind of like repeating it a couple times. It's like, oh, she cooks him something and he's like, oh, this is so delicious because it's from you. And then she's like, oh my God. But like, it's still good every time. More feedback. Constructive criticism. Oh, we wouldn't like criticize her food. It's already probably like perfect. Where's Gordon Ramsay at? Could you imagine it? <laughs> if... Uh, if uh, Amade was like Gordon Ramsay and be like, this tastes like shit, what is this? No, that'd be so mean to her. Oh. Hmm? oh give me the pudding back. No, come back here. Oh. She gets so worked up, dude. She gets so worked up, and then she gets so embarrassed and has to hide her face. Hmm. The prince is getting more screen time, and it looks like he's trying to be friends with us. Oh. I, I genuinely think he's a good person, but it's interesting now that he's coming into play. Because for like, what, eight episodes, hasn't had much screen time. Yeah. <laughs> Look at him blushing. <laughs> oh, wait, hold up. Only, uh, only Mahiro gets to make him blush. Oh, she's peeking. She's like, hmm. hmm. Is she jealous? I don't know. I think she's jealous. Because he's taking precious time away from her. Maybe? I don't know. What was that? That they get to hang out? Yeah. Why don't you just hang out with us at school then? Yeah. I mean, you can do it too, but obviously if she did that, right? Oh, look at her looking away. But obviously if she did that, it'd be a bit different. And then everybody else is going to be like, whoa, what do they got going on? Because it's boy and girl, right? And at that point, you kind of just have to establish that it's got to be a relationship. But, well, I mean, it's not like we have to hide that they're in a relationship either. I mean, if you did that, I don't know if that would be... I mean, I'd be, I'd be great, but I, I don't know. <laughs> Completely natural, like you guys are just friends, right? Definitely not a girl that comes over to his house and cooks some food. And... Just hang out with us then, come on! Just do it! Just do it! Is that a problem? Like, I mean, who cares? But I think for the story, it's more interesting if they try to, like, you know, not go straight into this, like, oh, we're girlfriend and boyfriend already. <gasps> the angel is picking this guy? What's going on? <laughs> They're all going to be so jealous. Everyone's going to be so impressed. I don't know if the school knows about Mahiru's like cooking skills, but the teacher here or something, the judge is going to be like, Oh my god, this is the angels cooking. And everyone's going to be like, wow. Hmm? You're really, I don't know. In sync? A newlyweds? Yes. <laughs> she can be a little cold sometimes. Hey, you, we're not newlyweds just yet. Yep, embarrassed. The blush, there it is. The char is the best part. No, I know it's bad. Like, charring the food is not very good. Like, oh, oh, oh. Hey, careful. Oh, shit. That's some hot shit. That could have been so bad. Oh, my God. But I think he saved her. I think he saved her. 
Did he catch her in a romantic way, though? <laughs> okay, okay. I thought he might have been like, and she fell into his arms. <laughs> no, I'm good. But all eyes are on them now. And sure, he, he only saved her there, right? But like, the entire class might be like, hmm? what's going on here? Also, that was a really cool move. Wow. Oh, oh. Kind of true, yeah. Wow, he's so cool right now. <laughs> <laughs> one of the girls went on one of the guys too, but I get what he's trying to say. Damn, dude! Yes, sir. Look how protective of Mairu right now. I think she's just like, wow. Holy shit. <laughs> wow, dude, there's this side of him too. He was very cool and bold. Yeah. It's not like I wanted to grab her. Oh, come on. I mean, that sounds like you don't want to grab her, but... I mean, I think he would like to, but... Yeah. He was very bold there. I think Mairu's heart kind of went... Oh, doki doki. He's so cool. Oh my god. He saved me! <laughs> Causes problems? Nah, nah. I think we should just... Slowly, slowly do stuff like hanging out... Holding hands. I don't know. It's it wouldn't be bad, right? Like, what would the public perception at school do to us? Just a friend. What are we then? What are we then, huh? Boyfriend, girlfriend. What are we then, huh? Here, here, here. here. Let me pat your head. Are you okay? <laughs> are you feeling down? Are they ever gonna explicitly state what they are? <laughs> yeah, that, that was the default head pack because it's like, oh shit, I don't know what to do. Anyone else? No. Head packs are strictly for you. No one else. <laughs> Fuck! <laughs> oh, she said Baka too today. So did Amane later. I mean, before. How much work? It'll never happen. Am I missing something here? She's being very abstract. How much... Is she implying that she needs to work hard so that they can actually be boyfriend and girlfriend? Or did I miss something there? Or are they talking about a different project in itself? I, I don't know. I, I think it's more of like... She wants to be seen with him in public. Give me more headpads, please. Uh, okay. This is adorable. Look at, oh, look at her eyebrows going from like angry to... Oh, okay. I'm happy now. That's cute though. At the end there, when Mahiru was saying, how much more work is it going to take? I had a misunderstanding. It's pretty much like she's working hard so that they want to be seen in public together to be as friends, but maybe more than friends because clearly they're in love with each other. It's interesting how every... Uh, all the past episodes has been focused more at like home right there are two dynamics and they've obviously bonded really well and they're kind of at a level where they might as well be just holding hands in public but we can't just do that too soon how will they ease into it and more importantly what is the prince doing because i think he's just gonna be like a good friend to amine and then maybe you saw the, the parallel between the prince and then you know the previous like trauma he had in middle school or something so i guess he's gonna be like a good friend that's gonna mend his past and something like that i don't really know but hey if you're still here if you enjoyed this reaction please subscribe and check out the other videos and playlists on my channel for even more content and until next time take care